Hello guys and welcome to another shocking revelation about what is happening in the political landscape of South Africa. In a surprising turn of events, Democratic Alliance, DA, Federal Council Chairperson Helen Zill has sharply criticized President Cyril Ramaphosa following his recent cabinet announcement. But before we continue, kindly subscribe, turn on the notification bell to stay updated when next we post new videos. Zill's comments come in the wake of a contentious reshuffling that has ignited debates across the South African political spectrum. Zill did not hold back, pointedly referencing the statement of intent signed on June 14th, which aimed at fostering cooperation between the ANC and other political entities. Good thing that the president references the statement of intent that we signed on June 14th. Hope the ANC respects it going forward, she declared. Her statement hints at skepticism regarding the ANC's commitment to the agreement and its implications for the future of coalition politics in South Africa. The statement of intent, intended to guide collaborative efforts towards effective governance, was seen as a beacon of hope for many who believe that cross-party cooperation is essential for tackling the country's pressing issues. However, Zill's remarks suggest that the DA harbors doubts about the ANC's adherence to the spirit of this agreement, especially in light of the new cabinet appointments. Critics within the DA argue that the recent cabinet reshuffle does not reflect the collaborative spirit promised by the statement of intent. They contend that the appointments are more indicative of the ANC's internal politics rather than a genuine effort to incorporate diverse perspectives. This sentiment is echoed by Zill's pointed reminder of the June 14th agreement, underscoring a perceived disconnect between the ANC's public commitments and its actual policy decisions. Supporters of President Ramaphosa, however, defend the reshuffle as a necessary step to consolidate his leadership and strengthen the government's capacity to address national challenges. They argue that the new cabinet composition is aimed at ensuring stability and continuity in governance, crucial for implementing long-term reforms. Political analysts suggest that Zill's comments may be a strategic move to hold the ANC accountable and to galvanize support within the DA space. By highlighting the statement of intent, Zill positions the DA as a watchdog committed to ensuring that the ANC lives up to its promises of inclusive and effective governance. The fallout from Zill's remarks is likely to reverberate through the corridors of power. The DA's skepticism, if shared by other parties, could strain the fragile cooperative spirit that the statement of intent sought to build. This development comes at a critical juncture for South Africa, which faces economic challenges, social unrest, and the need for cohesive leadership. In the coming weeks, the focus will be on whether the ANC can bridge the gap between its commitments and its actions. The success of the statement of intent and the broader goal of achieving effective governance depend on genuine collaboration and mutual respect among South Africa's political leaders. Zill's bombshell has undoubtedly intensified the scrutiny on President Ramaphosa's administration and its ability to foster a truly inclusive political environment. As the political landscape continues to evolve, the question remains, will the ANC honor the spirit of the statement of intent, or will Zill's concerns prove prophetic? Only time will tell as South Africa watches closely to see how these dynamics unfold. Thanks for watching the video until the end. Hope you found it useful. For more updates, check our other videos. Subscribe to stay updated when next we post videos.